Namaskaram, Hari Om and Sai Ram. Well, I just uh, came back from a Karumadi Bhajan, so I'm still with my costume. Um, anyway, I received a private message. A Bhajan lover asked me whether how I identif identify a raga when I listen to a Bhajan. So for me, it's all about reference, right? So, uh, just give you one short example so that I can make this video short, simple and sweet. I don't want to be too technical, okay? So, now if I'm going to take this bhajan, uh, lots of people name this uh, particular bhajan in, um, in this ragam called Madhya Mahapati, okay? So, like for me, um, I didn't learn the song from directly from the composer. So, um, usually what happens if I don't know the composer and I don't have any reference, I will try my best to sing it um, based on what I hear, okay? So like for me, uh, if I'm going to take Satya Sai Padam Bhujam, okay? Now, just this line, Bhava Bhaya Nashana, okay? It is uh, this particular word. Uh, line is in the middle of the song Bhava Bhayanashana Durita Nivarana So Bhava Bhayanashana Durita Nivarana Durita Nivarana So, okay, okay So, Bhava Bhayanashana itself So, if I'm going to sing Bhava Bhayanashana now once again, Bhava Bhaya Nashana Na I don't know whether you realize that Nashana, I actually oscillate that note. Na Bhava Bhaya Nashana My reference will be Dharma Sam Vardhani Okay, Bhava Bhaya Nashana. Now, to me, I will call this as Madhya Mavati. Okay, now if I'm going to sing it this way, Bhava Bhaya Nashana. Once again, Bhava Bhaya Nashana. Nashana Bhava Bhaya Papa Nisa. So towards the Sajam Bhava Bhaya Pani Sari. A hole on the re. Okay. Bhava Bhaya Nashana. So my reference will be Bhattavatsala Patita Pavana Patita Pavana Bhava Bhaya Nashana Now, in this context, I will call it as Sri Ragam. Okay, one more. Bhava Bhaya Nashana See, you slide it more or maybe you glide it Bhava Bhaya Nashana So for me, the reference would be Ranga Then automatically I will call this ragam as Brindavana Brindavana Saranga Brindavana Saranga Okay So reference point is very important And uh, I don't like to mix them all together in a particular bhajan So that 
Um, the reason is because I would like to give the listener a different flavor. So if I'm going to mix everything together, everything together, then there is no, uh, what is that? There is no variety, right? So that is how I identify ragam. And I hope that this helped you. And Sairam, take care and good night.